It's... Red! I call the shot. Red! Call the set! Call the set! Bro, my brother's starting to shoot me. Who's playing? This is intense. Oh shit, Cloud vs. Olimar? How do you feel about that? Uh, technically, it's ass for Olimar. And when played at the extremely high level. Yes. I just put the swing. 2 1. I talked to I'm hit points about like, the Olimar vs. Cloud matchup. And what I think told me was that Olimar. They're, they're saying you're a little too loud. Oh, my bad. Sorry, guys. <laughs> nope. I'm hit was no. telling me. Wait. Jen! Where'd you call him? No, where? Three. Three. Hey, wait. Three. You're Jen, right? You got like a fucking romance online, okay? I got you, man. You got like a little romance online, bro. I miss those days. You're not the only one. You're, not, you're not the first one to complain, so I got you, man. I'm in low-key fucking bits on the sides. Yeah, that mic picks up everything. So I usually put the hey, louder person on the, the mic that I'm using, but I'm right, I'm also loud. So Thrills, when you get too loud, people on the mics, it's Thrills. a little rough. Anywho, cloud, back to Shh. back to the game. It's the best uh, ever. Not looking good for Khan at the moment. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm a teacher on the side of, uh, during the school session. I'm a math teacher. <laughs> Ooh, training. Hey, back to this match real quick. Cause like it's very intriguing. I'm hip was telling me that <coughs> yeah, no problem, Tech Monus, we got you, man. I'm hip was telling me that this matchup is heavily in Cloud's favor. Because Cloud has a mechanic where he can do Nair, and Nair will just get all the Pikmin off. Oh yeah, because his hitbox, that hitbox is incredibly massive. And yes, Tech Bonus, he is seated number one. Oh really? Yes. That's crazy. Rakan plays, uh... uh Cloud and Rosa. Rosa. Yep. I like his Rosa, but I think Mao's Rosa is a bit better. That's probably just personal I think, preference. I think it, as far as Mao goes for Rosa, like where uh, Rakan is playing more Greed heavy and more optimal. Where Mal is just playing where he feels. He's almost like plays like a mango from melee. Um, where he just plays how he feels. Exactly. And Rakan's cloud is really good. Don't get me wrong, but you can tell that he's playing like most of the cloud's basics. Ooh. And he's getting frame trap really hard. You know, it was a two stock. Don't get me wrong. Both players played their best. But I can see, I can see a Rosa switch right now. But also at the same time, Rakan knows I'm hit plays against Mal all the time. So it's gonna be a really hard switch. It's semis, right? So it's best out of five? I'm hip switching the bail. Yes, it's best out of five. Okay. I'm hip is switching, or they're gonna. Uh, oh, he's gonna, he's gonna, he's gonna change his tag to I'm sold. Yeah. We all know. I'm not gonna lie, he's though. Controls. Bayonetta is really fucking good. Like, I, too, I was playing. Really good? You mean too good? Okay, I stopped, <laughs> <laughs> I stopped playing. I stopped playing Smash 4 to play Melee, right? And when I started playing Bayonetta, because I was intrigued with this character. It felt like a melee character. You have all the options to throw out to combat most of the top tiers. So it's more of like intelligence that comes into play. So now, I'm wondering what's going to happen in match. So, so I'm able to switch to Bayonetta and Rakan staying Cloud. What's your thoughts on this? On this, this is a pretty much your top level grand finals. This is what you're going to see at Evo kind of thing. I feel uh, it's, it. It's I'm hit starting with a very strong lead. Could potentially kill himself due to like his last up B right there. But since a smart player he is, he waited yeah. until his up B to grab ledge. Because Bayonetta, she struggles with landing lag. But since he knows Bayonetta can optimally have you no know, lag when she grabs ledge, this is amazing. This is truly amazing. My bad, I'm having my, my tanners on. Oh, you're good, dude. <laughs> but. Like where Hip is gonna thrive in this matchup is not only does Meteor also have a cloud now. Oh, um, Meteor's a cloud? Yes. That's he, amazing. He, so when Meteor is playing Hip, he pulls out of either cloud or Meta Knight. Um, so he, it, Hip's not unfamiliar with this matchup at all. Not only that, he That's also was so PR cloud. as well. You know, uh, but being Bayonetta, he can also 
Edge guard cloud like no other. Cloud doesn't have that limit. Ooh, that is scary off stage for Cloud. Cloud dominates on stage, but against Bayonetta, like a skillful Bayonetta, she was gonna play against him off stage. Was that like a bajillion up tilts for 60%? <laughs> and then now it's like even match in terms of socks. <laughs> it is. Hip just lapped. Uh, okay, so percent. he has no jump. Ooh, I thought nared, he, yeah, I would have nared in that position. I don't know if it would have been fast enough, but regardless, oh. it would have been it would have been no end lag. Okay, there's, so there's, yeah, off the there's, top, there's, there's, there is. excellent there play is. by I'm Hit. I would say so myself. He capitalized the fact that Cloud had no jumps whatsoever, and he killed him off the top with an up air because he couldn't do anything. Because he would air dodge, you get frame trapped with the up air, so he was dead regardless. And now it's a 2-0 in I'm Hit's favor, and are we, are we gonna see a counter pick switch? Oh, we're gonna see a change of characters. We're gonna switch to Lucina. So, what's your thoughts on that, bro? I actually really like the matchup uh, with a Mars or Marth or Lucina against a Bayo. What? I, just, I don't really know much about this game, but Lucina, Bayo. How so, does that work out? So, so as far as the because Bayo wins pretty much uh, pretty much every single matchup in the entire game. Okay. Uh, but with okay, I, I hate to stop you, but I heard Bayo does really or Bayo does really bad against Jimmy Buff. Is that true? <laughs> well, I I couldn't tell you, man. I haven't seen it yet. Once I see it, I'll believe it. Once I see it, because Bro? because oh man, because Jigglypuff is so light that just it's pretty much a true combo for her for her ladders. Okay. Yeah. I don't know. I'm just asking because like I remember someone posted online like years ago, so I'm not too sure if it's like a team or it's real. <laughs> But according Ooh. to this match, it does look like Bayonetta does really good against Mars and Lucina. Cause yeah, it might it might look like Bayonetta is struggling right now, but it's more like I'm hip trying to fill the waters. You know what I mean? Well, see that, that that's the thing with with Bayo. Once she gets in, that's where the damage goes. It's think of Bayo as almost like a godlike fox. Because <laughs> once Fox gets in, boom, there goes that percent all the way up. You know but Bayo, funny? there's no there's no punishment. It, it, like like Bayo, she's not gonna get comboed as easy as Fox. He's not gonna get punished off stage as Fox. Like it's just, and not only that, Bale can combo off the top, just like Fox can, but even better. Uh, but in this, like, a fortunate Marcino, kill non-tech by Rakan himself versus Lime Hip. The Mar Marcina is just they could keep if played properly and played safely. Marcina can keep that Bale out from getting that initial combo in. So if they get that. So they just keep doing that fair, keeping that zone out and that, that good stuff. Uh, Bayo's not going to get that up to, or that combo starter. Well, not only, not, sorry, go ahead. Okay, so right now, looking at the matchup, it really does look like it's 50-50. You know? Yeah, like, Mar like even though Lucina might be struggling against Bayonetta, you can still see the spacing from Rakan is really excellent. I mean, from coming, because I'm a Marth main in Melee. I, I love Marth. But right now what I'm seeing from the perfect up to right there, it was amazing from Rakan's part. And now the percentage game is even. And Dancing Blade plays a huge factor in this game in particular. And look at that hitbox. And then I'm hit almost pineapple himself, <laughs> but Rakan didn't capitalize on the fact that he was on his last up B. So now he might get punished on the fact that he didn't really punish that. So well, now, ooh, great read by I'm hit right there, I would say so myself. Because he read, he read the spot dodge in place and waited. I'm sold is amazing. I've never <laughs> seen I'm sold play Ooh, this fucking god -like. His bail has 100% leveled up since you've last seen him. His Dude, bail is, congratulations. is very, very good. 